Right, hi there. So this is just going to be a quick video. It's not a how-to. Uh, this is just me showing you what I've done to my 3D printer. And it's pretty simple to do anyway. Uh, you've probably done it uh, assembled and disassembled your hot end before. So you're going to know how to do this. So with my 3D printer, what I've done is I have put a E3D Volcano hot end on here with a 0.8mm nozzle. The uh, main reason for doing this is is because I'm impatient and I don't like waiting 25, 30 hours for large prints to finish and I don't always need uh, the resolution of what a 0.4mm nozzle will give you. Uh, there's nothing wrong with the standard um, hot end and nozzle, it works perfectly fine. I didn't have any problems with it, but I just wanted to upgrade it. I've got other 3D printers, so uh, I've got 0.4mm nozzles on them, and I also uh, have another 3D printer with a Volcano hot end on, a genuine one. Uh, that's how come I've got that genuine um, E3D Volcano silicon sock there. Uh, the one that's on here is actually a clone, and I mean, it's super cheap, I mean it's like two dollars for the uh, uh, Volcano hot end and then like a dollar for the um, nozzles. So for three dollars you could upgrade your uh, Anet A2 or Anet A8 or A6 to a Volcano hot end and be able to print a lot faster. Uh, so as you can see there it's just got the same uh, PTFE 9 throat on there and the same cold end so nothing's changed it's, it, sh it shares a, the um, M6 uh, thread which the <coughs> standard one does so it's just a straight switch just bang it on there and away you go uh, here is a print that I've done with it this is a single layer in phase mode 0.4 millimeters and also you'll find that your 3d prints are a lot stronger if this was a uh, 0.4mm nozzle, uh, I would probably crack, crack it uh, when squishing it like this. Yeah, it makes uh, very strong prints. So if you want um, you know, a lot more strength in your prints with just a single layer, uh, this is definitely the way to go. So yeah, I'll put links in the description anyway. Uh, please comment down below, tell me what you think. Uh, if you've got any questions, uh, comment. Uh, please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and please subscribe and hit that bell icon side of the subscription button and That means then next time I make a video you'll be notified of it. Okay, so I just want to thank you for watching and uh, I'll see you next time. Bye